Hi, my name is Ishan Beg, and welcome to the new video. And in my previous video, I've demonstrated that uh, how to create a web service from a Java class in JDeveloper 11G, and we deployed that to Java class to our web logic server, and we have tested that. So, if you want to see that video, you can find a link in the video description, and. Uh, this is the our address of our, our visual document now in this video i will utilize this web service in another application and let's see how to do this we'll create a new application and this time we'll take a fusion web application and uh, give it a name that my test app and uh, we'll create a uh, the project technologies we have to use the web services in the model layer so we can utilize web services in the model project and finish now to create uh, we require we are it is required to create a data control on the web service so on model project I will right click select new in the web service tab I will select web service data control and I will give it a name that my WS uh, data control for example it is asking for the URL of the visual document will simple copy this and paste it here this method uh, we already created called say hello you can see here also so we are going to use this method in our page and the rest we can take as default now you can if you see in the data control section we have this data control with the method say hello which takes a uh, argument and return the string type so let's create a page and we'll quickly go through this and now I will add a panel splitter and uh, I will drag and drop this method to the first facet as ADF parameter form. The label I will give as input name and uh, JDeveloper will automatically create uh, in text and the button for this. Yeah, you can see and this is the return type of this method we will drag and drop to the second facet as output text now we are ready to test our application let's save this right click the page and run uh, you can see our page is ready now I will put input name press say hello and it should return this hello bake you can see and we can say world and it's returning hello world and there we go so we have seen in these two videos how to create web services from java class and then we have utilized that web service in another fusion application so hope you like the videos and uh, find it useful feel free to comment it you can download the sample code uh, thanks for watching goodbye